Welcome back to another fabulous edition of Urban Green Bee. Today, I'm going to Oak Ridge Elementary School to teach five different classes of third graders about honeybees and why they're important. Um, but what I wanted to show you is some good waggle dance action that we've got going on. I'm just going to turn the observation hive around and let you see. So you can see several different waggle dances going on and you can also see several bees with their pollen baskets full of some nice bright pollen. So let's zoom in on a waggle dance. Where do we see a good one? There's one. And you can see you're doing the figure eights with the waggle up the center. And again, the angle at which she does it tells the other bees which direction to go in reference to the sun when she leaves the hive. And the waggle up the center is supposed to help determine um, how far away it is from the hive, and how fast she does the dance indicates how good the source of her dance is, so what quality of pollen or nectar. And here's another good dance. So I just thought I'd get a little bit of footage of that on this beautiful day. Please, well, I won't be posting this till later, but I hope that I do well today. Uh, I prepared a little presentation for the third graders, so I'm going to show them pictures. I have those big, glossy pictures for, that did aunt sells that shows um, big zoomed in pictures of honeybees and shows a beekeeper in different frames and things like that. Those, and they're really big, so that's good. And I have some large almost anatomically correct honeybee models and a couple sets of honeybee development brood stages, little plastic models of that so it shows the cell, the larvae, the pupae, and adult. Um, what else? We're going to be planting um, giant sunflower seeds um, to teach the children about uh, ecosystem enhancement, a project that I'm working on right now that I need to tell you all about a little more. Um, but I'm going to teach the children the importance of the bees, what services they provide, and what they can do to help bees. So, oh, and I also printed out 150 copies of a very simple honeybee anatomy coloring sheet. I need to drink some water. I'll let you know how it goes.